Hello everyone, we have the Ceiling Sword Peaks of Time. So I will be showing how to go through this when I get all the rewards from here. Um, the first thing I will do is I will look over to my left and I will clear up some of this um, fog over here. Um, just so I can see a little bit more. And we do have a, the Mayor's House. So let's go ahead and speak with the Mayor here. Now that we have spoken with the Mayor, we can go up and around over here. We do have um, two camps over here, so I will go ahead and take down both of these camps right here. And a good thing to note here, you do get some um, relics from here, which is very nice. And I have taken down both of the camps. So um, that frees up these two chests as well. So let's go ahead and um, collect these chests here. And moving up, we do have another camp right up here blocking the way, so let's go ahead and take this camp down. Here we go, we got, um, took down that camp, and also with that camp out of the way, let's go ahead and move over to the right, and um, let's collect this chest over here, and right above us here we do have another camp, let's go ahead and take this camp down as well. And there we go, that camp is also down, and um, I did see a chest over here, so let's go ahead and collect this chest. And moving over to the left here, um, we do have a, a big camp right here, let's go ahead and take this camp down. And remember, these camps do have relics in them, so if you need to um, get some relics, go ahead and take down some of the camps that I'm skipping here. And there we go, took down the big camp there, getting a legendary relic, so very nice to see getting those kind of relics this early. And looking over here, we do have uh, another chest. Let's go ahead and pick up this chest right here. Okay, let's move down to the bottom here, over to the right a little bit. Moving back into this main area, we do have the mayor's house again. Let's go ahead and speak with the mayor uh, right down here. Okay, let's continue moving over to the right here. Um, we're looking at this bottom right corner that is covered by um, the shadow over here. Let's go ahead and reveal what's down over here. Um, we do have a um, area. We go ahead and put some water into the bucket that we received from the mayor. So let's go ahead and move back up here. Um, we do have this fire here specifically. Let's go ahead and put this fire out um, with the bucket of water that we just got. And now with that fire out of the way, we can go ahead and get the next chest right here. And we are going to want to fill that bucket, bucket back up with water, so we will move back down to that same area. And then moving back up here, um, there's another fire that we need to, need to take care of. It's this one right here. And then we have another chest right here. Let's go ahead and get this chest. And it looks like we have two camps right here. Let's go ahead and take down both of these camps. Okay, both of those camps are down, so very good. And we do have another camp up here, unfortunately, that we need to take down. Okay, I took down that camp as well. And I do see another camp over here. I think if I can, I think I'm going to skip that one because I don't think we actually need to take down that camp. But I will go over here to the right and take this camp down. And there we go, took down that camp there, and now we can go ahead and get the next chest. And you can see there's another camp down to the bottom right here that we also need to take down. And there we go, took down that camp as well. I'll go with that rock there. Also going to get um, this chest. And now we, um, this part is pretty important, guys, because we will battle this camp right here but we will actually um, be forced to lose. So you have to lose this one. Um, I believe your heroes do respawn though after you lose, so don't worry about um, changing heroes out. You can just keep your formation and your heroes should be revived. And there we go guys, I lost that battle, so um, we should be teleported away from here. Yeah, we, we were supposed to lose that one, so don't worry. And now we are teleported back to where we started. So now what we have to do, we have to go um, talk with the uh, mayor here again. So it's pretty much the first thing that we had to do. Okay, so I'm going to move up. Um, I'm going to move towards this path right here. We do have a raised camp right here. On That's, that's the um, tile there that's all burnt. Let's go ahead and investigate this. And at this point, we do have to take down at least one of these camps to progress. Okay, I took down that bottom camp there, and we do see a chest right down here, so let's go ahead and um, get this chest. And for a little bit here, it's just going to be um, taking down these camps and collecting some of these chests here, so the next one will be this camp right here. 
Okay, and then we can go ahead and um, get this chest right over here with that camp out of the way. And I will go directly up here towards this camp that is blocking the chest over here. And there we go, let's go ahead and get this chest right over here. And after this chest, I will move directly over to the left here, and there should be another chest right here, so let's go ahead and get this chest as well. And from here, I think I'm going to try and um, move up over around here, as we don't necessarily have to take down this camp, so I'm not really going to do that. But we do have to take down this camp right here. And now with that camp out of the way, we can go ahead and get the Witch's Relic. Let's go ahead and open this chest to reveal the potion. So now it tells us that we need to go to the lake. So what we're going to do is we are going to move all the way down here. And it should be in this corner. This should be where we need to go for the next part of this. So it's right over here. This is the next chest that we need to get. Let's go ahead and open the floating treasure. And now we need to move back on land, but we are actually going to be in a different part here. We're actually going to move right over here because there is a chest right here. So let's go ahead and get this chest. And then moving back onto into the water briefly, we will go ahead and move over here and take down this camp. And there we go. We can go ahead and get the next chest right here. And over to our left, we do have another camp. Let's go ahead and take down this camp. And there we go, we can go ahead and get the next chest, and unfortunately we do need to take down uh, this camp right here. And there we go, let's go ahead and get the next chest, and then we'll go ahead and move over to our right, and then down this little narrow hallway, over to um, this camp that's over here. And there we go, another camp, another camp there is down, let's go ahead and get this chest, and then we do have this um, big camp that we need to, need to take down as well. And now we can go ahead and move up here to the witch. Let's go ahead and speak uh, with the witch here. And now that we've done that, we need to go back um, over to this uh, main area over here. And we need to go ahead and speak with the mayor once again. And now it seems like the next step is to go ahead and um, try to take down this big camp that we tried to take down before. Um, I believe it should be weaker this time and we should be able to get this one down. And there we go guys, took down that final boss. So let's go ahead and um, get the final chest right here. I believe this is the final chest anyway. But it also showed us something up here. Um, it showed another thing spawn up here. So I guess I will go ahead and speak with the witch again just to see what happens. I don't know what will happen, but let's go ahead. But it says the witch isn't accepting any more visitors, so... Um, maybe there's a maybe there's a secret path you can take, but I believe I did get all of the uh, um, all the chests here. Yep, I got a hundred percent of everything. So let's go ahead and finish the adventure. Hey, if you made it to the end of this video and haven't subscribed yet, make sure to like and subscribe. Also, comment what did you think about this Peaks of Time adventure? And there will be a video on screen that YouTube thinks you would like to watch next. So go ahead and click on that video right now. And thanks for watching.